Hey guys, I'm Justin Z, and I'm showing you how to use Photoshop. In this particular video, I'm going to show you how to remove clothes with Photoshop. Now, I'm not talking to remove an entire shirt or a pair of pants or something like that. I'm basically talking about more simple things like, say, a, uh, a bra or underwear, things like that. And the reason why I bring this up is, let's say you have a really nice picture of yourself um, with your back turned away while wearing a bikini and you want to make it a little sexier and remove the bikini from the back. Well, it's pretty easy to do, and I'll show you how to do that right now. So I have this picture right here of a lady at a beach and she's got a kind of a G-string top going on, which is pretty easy to remove. I'm going to show you the tools how to do this. The first tool that I want you to use is the spot healing brush tool, which is right here. Now let's zoom in a little bit more. You click on that, you click and drag, and that's the first one you get. And I'm very simply going to click and drag this area right there, and voila, it gets rid of it, um, as if it were never there. Let's do it again, and again, whoops. Sometimes it's not perfect, so you gotta be careful on where, where you decide to, look, to use it. And if it, eventually it will outlive its usefulness and you'll have to uh, start using the regular healing brush tool. So just you keep clicking and clicking and clicking until it decides to not behave as well. You'll also notice that as you click, you need to start paying attention to the curves of her back so it doesn't look unnatural. But as long as you keep clicking, you can mostly get rid of it. But as you can see, there's definitely some curves that need to be addressed, such as this little area right here. You can still tell that the curve around where her bra was needs to be changed. But hey, it's looking pretty good. So let's go ahead and grab the healing brush tool. Now in order to use it proper, you have to press and hold the Alter Option key and use your little marker to click on an area. And then you'll notice that I can proportionally make changes. There we go. Now it doesn't look like there's, that her skin is being pushed in. And it also gives it a nice sense of feeling uh, as to whether or not it's there. And there's a couple little extra things I want to do, like her, you can tell the difference between right here and her arm. So hold Option and press and click. And then so we're just going to click once, oops, right there should do the job. There we go, it looks pretty good. So let's go ahead and look at it beforehand and after. Zoom in a little bit, before and after. She looks like she's topless now. So it looks pretty good. So that's pretty much all there is to it when it comes to this. It can be done with anything unless there's a large amount of detail because you need to reference the detail. So if a person's wearing a full shirt, it's not going to work because you don't know what's under there. But simple things like that, you can remove it without, with, with, while creating a negligible amount of difference, if any difference at all. So if you have any questions regarding this or with Photoshop in general, please send me an email to requests at, at uh, mahalo.com. Thanks for watching, guys. Please be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe.